Welcome back to McPhee Ford. Today we're taking a look at this brand new 2024 Ford Maverick. This Maverick is an XLT model and it's finished in a brand new color for 2024 called Terrain. Almost like a sand-like color, gives it a really sharp look here. And this one's also equipped with the black appearance package. And the black appearance package is available in other Ford models like the F-150 and Super Duty. And we have it now on the Maverick model. Now we're gonna start here with the front end. Gonna have the gloss black grille here, even a blacked out Ford logo. You have LED lighting as well. Really, really sharp looking front end here. And then coming around to the side, we're also gonna, gonna have your blacked out wheels. It has a nice matte finish there, so it gives it a really sharp look. Wrapped in a Michelin all season tire. Blacked out XLT badging, as well as the mirror. And then coming around to the back end here, we are gonna get the blacked out or darkened housing for the taillight as well. And this one is equipped with the trailer tow package. You're gonna have uh, your hitch receiver back here with the four and seven pin connection with the trailer brake controller inside as well. We'll go ahead and lower down the tailgate. This one does have a drop-in bed liner. This is a Ford OEM drop-in liner. There's also gonna be a 400 watt inverter outlet back here. We have LED box lighting and lots of different tie-down points. Taking a look into the interior of the Maverick, being equipped with the black appearance package, we are gonna get the black cloth seats. Now on this driver's side, it is fully power operated and they're heated, so they're very, very comfortable. This one does have the XLT luxury package, so we're gonna get a couple of extra features and amenities. Same with the door panel here, you get some nice blue and the black. Now we'll go ahead and step into the driver's seat here. We're gonna have the switchblade style key with remote start. And we'll go ahead and fire up the 2.0-liter EcoBoost engine. It's paired to an 8-speed automatic transmission, and all-wheel drive is standard with the 2.0-liter. Now, there's also the hybrid option available, uh, which is offered as a front-wheel drive vehicle if you're looking for that extra fuel economy uh, and efficiency. Off to the left side here, you've got your automatic headlights and also the trailer brake controller. So this one does have the 4K tow package, so you can tow up to 4,000 pounds, which is a very healthy towing uh, capacity, you know, jet skis, maybe small campers, uh, whatever the case is, you can do it properly, and especially with the you know, electric brakes on the trailer. Now moving on to the steering wheel, nicely wrapped here, you're gonna have the heated function, you get your heated steering wheel uh, right there in the middle, so it's very comfortable in the, in the, in the wintertime. Cruise control button's there, Got your audio and media controls on the right side. And then the eight inch dis uh, display here is actually gonna be standard across every single Maverick. So it's very well integrated in the vehicle. It's gonna include Apple CarPlay, you get Android Auto, you know, all the different connectivity options there. And then climate control down below, loads and loads of storage here. That's kind of the main design aspect of the Maverick is storage and the you know intuitive thoughts of the storage systems here. You got phone storage and you know, of course cup holders and just different different layouts for that. Got some USB and then 12 volt connectors, as well as the glove box and even storage on top of the dash. Taking a look into the rear seat, you get loads of space back here and the Maverick is only available in one configuration, which is kind of your full four door model with the four and a half foot bed. Very popular way to configure you know, an F-150 or a Ranger is the full four door model. So that's why Ford went this way. Uh, just like the front, you get the black cloth seats back here also have a center armrest in the middle, two different cup holders, and then you can also fold the, uh, or lift the rear cushion up there so you get lots of space underneath. And you can maybe keep some valuables kind of hidden away and out of plain sight. This one has the rubber floor mats included as well, so those are gonna be installed here shortly, so you get the protection there for the floor. Also gonna have another 400 watt inverter outlet there on the back of the console, and two different USB connectors to keep all your different devices charged up. So if you're interested in this particular Ford Maverick XLT that is for sale here at McPhee Ford, you can either give us a call or you can visit our website, mcpheeford.com. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.